Hi everyone, so this is my uh, Verizon Files setup. It is a Motorola Optic Network Terminal and uh, the model number is um, ONT1000GT2 and, um, and I think this is the new one. It, it has eight, uh, eight ports for telephone and uh, the Ethernet goes here and this is the test line and then here's where the fiber goes in but it's locked right now and I don't want to open it and you see all the indicator lights on the side and the, the battery backup unit and the power supply is uh, directly behind this wall and it's plugged into a uh, outlet. It goes down there and then goes in the wall to the wall to the receptacle in the back. So this is the Verizon router that I got uh, for the files, and as you can see, the unit itself is pretty large in size compared to my uh, Linksys router, and. Uh, as you can see, it's connected through Mocha, and the blue wire goes directly to my Linksys router running on DDWRT's firmware. And I have uh, the Linksys has two antennas. One's the stock one, and I replaced the other one with a link with a D-Link antenna. Uh, so I don't know if the wireless range improves but I think it helps a little bit and uh, I'm also going to do a speed test comparison from with the old DSL connection to the uh, files connection and see how much improvements I've made uh, after switching <laughs> 